Hey, it's Dustin from SalonGrowthAcademy.com and I help salon and spa professionals grow their business through building a professional website and then driving traffic to that website. And I make these YouTube videos because there's a lot of broke hairstylists out there and I don't want you to be one of them. So, beautiful day, going for a walk. I wanted to talk to you about something that's on my mind. And that is how to drive traffic to your website or how to grow your business. Now, there is a lot of people out there because this is what you're taught in beauty school that believe the way to grow your business, pass out business cards, and use Instagram, okay? If you asked any new hairstylist or existing hairstylist or anybody, and you're probably thinking it right now, Instagram's the way to grow your hair business. And I'm gonna say I completely disagree. There's three reasons why I wanna tell you those reasons in this video. First reason is Instagram is not a search engine, okay? When people are in, you know, a, wherever city that they're in, or you do hair, and they're looking for a new hairstylist, the way that they do that is through searching. Now, the easiest way to find something that you're looking for is Google. That's where everybody goes when they try and find, when they try and find something new. Now, there are a few select people, few and far between, that use Instagram, I know they're out there, as a search engine. They'll go to, search, they'll go to Instagram, and if they wanna to go to a new restaurant, they'll use Instagram to find that new restaurant. If they want to go um, find a new hairstylist, they'll use Instagram to find that hairstylist. But like I said, they're few and far between because Instagram is not designed to be a search engine. It is a platform to show your images and short videos. The easiest path to find that hairstylist is go to Google. What Google does is it clicks over, when you click on something, it takes you to a website. So that's why a website is so important. And um, that's why I think it's the number one thing that you need in your business. And by the way, if you're interested in learning how to build a website um, by yourself, I have an online course. It's a do-it-yourself kind of thing. It's excellent. Um, you can watch it in less than two hours and have your website up and running if you follow my step-by-step -step instructions within 24 hours, okay? That's not what this video is about, but if you're looking to do that, definitely go there and sign up for Salon Website Academy at salonwebsiteacademy.com. The second reason not to use Instagram to grow your business, actually, I said that wrong. Definitely use Instagram. It just shouldn't be your go-to to grow your business. It shouldn't be like the thing that you rely on because um, you will get some clients from it. But if you're trying to grow your business and get um, you know, 30, 40 new clients per month, that is not realistic with Instagram. The second reason why is because it just takes up too much time. So everything that I do, I kind of run through this rubric of a cost-benefit analysis. And your time is something that's really valuable. So that's, some, that's what it's costing you is your time. So if you need to take images of, you know, if you did a great um, cut and color and you take a picture of that and you post it on Instagram, first of all, you gotta, you gotta take good pictures. So you have to figure out how to do that. Second, you probably gotta edit them a little bit. And then third, it takes time and you have to be very consistent with that. Like consistency in marketing is number one thing. Um, unless you have a website that works for you 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and it does the work for you on autopilot. That's the second reason I like websites. But anyway, we're talking about Instagram. And the second reason is because it just takes time. So like, would you rather be spending your time actually doing things that make you income, like cutting and coloring hair? Or do you wanna spend your time um, posting on Instagram? When you could be using that, I mean, if you're not making money, you could be doing things with your family or with your friends or, or whatever. And so if, if you're like, hey, I need to be doing this all the time, you're stressing out about all the time that you need to spend um, posting on Instagram, it's just not the way to go. And finally, the third reason that Instagram is not the go-to to build your business is because the Instagram platform wasn't designed to help you grow your business. It was designed natively to show off images. It was designed for people, like Instagram wants people to stay on Instagram. And the way that they do that is by, you know, you can get addicted by just scrolling through and looking at images and looking at images and looking at images. They want you to do that. They don't ever want you to leave Instagram because they make money by um, their advertisers. And the longer you stay on Instagram, the more advertisements they can send you, the more advertisements they can send you, the more money they make, and that's what they want. So they don't ever want you to leave Instagram. So natively, they make it difficult. Notice, they only let you put a link in the bio. They can't, you can't put links in specific posts. Um, that's because they don't want you to leave, okay? They make it difficult for the user to be able to click off of Instagram um, 
to go to a new website. And ultimately as a business owner, as a salon professional, we want them to leave whatever it is, get to our website so they can schedule an appointment. So if you are like, yeah, that makes sense. And I've been doing it wrong and I wanna do it right. Um, I want you to go over to my website and check it out, salongrowthacademy.com. If you click the contact page, that'll give you a list of all the done for you services. Um, I can help you with your website. If you're a do-it-yourselfer, there's an online course there. It's really inexpensive. That'll teach you the step-by-step -step instructions of how to build a beautiful website that converts, do it all by yourself. And like I said, you'll have it done in the next couple days. Um, and, and so that's a quick and easy and efficient way to do it. The other thing is um, I can build a really simple templated website for you. That's really inexpensive as well. And I can have that done in a couple days for you. So time is really important. You want to get things done. So go over to salongrowthacademy.com forward slash contact or just click the contact page. All the information is there. If you have any questions, you can reach out to me using that contact form there. So thanks so much for watching and make today extraordinary.